Hi Info Ramblers, sorry my video was late. Um, I've been working like quite a few shifts and I've just not been getting the sleep. Like last night I was just falling asleep constantly. Um, but I'm refreshed more so now. So yeah, the topic for this week was about stereotypes and I just wanted to define stereotypes. A stereotype is something that is used to talk about something more easily by association. Um, so for example, uh, if you were to see a hooded young youth, you would associate them with being, no, normally you would stereotype them and associate them with being a, maybe a thug or bad or negative. But if you saw someone who was well dressed, uh, well groomed, uh, a fancy car, you might expect them to have a good job, to be quite nice, a good person, polite. But um, stereotypes don't exactly work like that. For example, the, the hood of the youth could be just, you know, just a guy wearing a hood. Um, the, the man who has all the money and the nice clothes might be a real moron, a real bad guy in real life. Uh, yeah, stereotypes are a way to easy, easily classify people. And sometimes, sometimes they're right. Sometimes hooded, uh, the majority of hooded youths might just be all horrible people and people who have fancy cars and lots of money have worked hard and... I've earned it. Maybe, maybe that's right. Maybe that's wrong. But um, yeah, advertising stereotyping is used in advertising. It's a way to find an audience and to quickly grasp them and their intention to say, okay, this is the product we're going to sell you. This is what you're going to get. So, girly girls um are constantly um advertised at um having the right hair, having the right makeup, having the right look, the right clothes. Um, but you know. It, it, are they a good thing or are they a bad thing? Well, they can be a good thing because they make it so much easier just to say, oh, this person is such and such, and then they are labelled and then you know exactly who they are. They can be negative because then you might like not get to know someone because you think they're someone that you already think they are. Like, I had a friend, I, I've met someone recently who said quite openly that she used to be somewhat of a chav. Or a, a, um, I'm trying to think how to describe a chav to Americans. Uh, a chav is a... Uh, a punk? No. Um, a chav is a person who wears hoods, drinks, is a bit of a, a bit of a loser, basically. Um, but she, yes, and yeah, it's bad. It's a bad person. Uh, yeah, but she realised that she was being associated with this image and this life lifestyle, and decided to change. She still wears the same clothes she wears, but she tries to carry her attitude in a different way. So she tries to overcome the stereotype. Yeah. Um, if someone were to look at me and stereotype me, I imagine they would just stereotype me as a bumbling British uh, YouTuber. Um, I've been called worse in the past because um, stereotypes can hurt and sometimes. Uh, I won't go into that. But yes, yeah, stereotypes can be used to insult people. Um, they can be taken out of their context. Uh, yeah, stereotypes. They are b both good and bad depending on the circumstance with, of what they are used within. Okay, um, just something I wanted to talk about quickly. Um, I've been thinking, because there's four of us, uh, and we're all, we're all at a point of our lives now at the moment where things are starting to change, so it's becoming a little bit harder for us to make videos. Um, in a few weeks' time, it'll be easier again for me to be making videos because I'll be back at home and I'll uh, be in a stable environment. And I won't be moving about every as much as I am now. But um, Ruth, I know uh, you, you're pretty much in the same situation as me. Alex, I know you've got exams. Brendan, we know you're pretty much out of the loop at the moment because of blah blah. Uh, but I was thinking, because there's four of us, essentially, maybe it might be an interesting idea to bring on two more inform ramblers, so there's six of us. And I was thinking, let's keep it so we have one person from Britain, one person, or one person from England, I should say. England, America, Australia, Canada, and maybe try and get another one of a boy and one of a girl from two different countries and then we might bring some new fresh blood into the channel and we might get some more active video making uh, yeah it's just an idea um i ha if you were to do it and if you're watching if you're interested and if you're a boy or a girl from a different country then um there would be some requirements uh, which we would set at a later point but let me know do you reckon we could, should bring on two more ramblers let me know bye